Juliet, read this. Of course. Lying. I'm sorry. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Warren's flash drive? Doo -doo -doo. I love how she knew it was Warren's flash drive, yet she still did Almost it. done. Get the flash drive, and then I'll go see Warren. Let's speak hey, to her Dana. real quick. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real How's mature. That even oh. I literally can only move in a circle. Poor Juliet gets her rage on. I hope she doesn't kill Victoria. Zachary should worry too. As if I'd let that ego case jockstrap touch me. But I bet Victoria would be all over that action. Or has been. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. What do you mean? He's a good guy. He's a good guy. A geek like me. You saw the files in his flash drive. Tons of crazy <laughs> shit. Films I've like never, never heard even of. heard of. <laughs> and in a special folder called Max. Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Oh, we get Are it. He blushing? has crush on us. <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. Whenever. Let's check out this. That looks like a home pregnancy test. And the results are in. <gasps> oh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Attitude. But... Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. There's no more but I could rewind and make it up to so her. Go. Oh? Slow-mo. Imagine if, like, rewind, like... Hey, Dana. I heard a rumor about Dana. you. Dana. I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. <laughs> Can you keep a secret, Max? Oh? You're pregnant? You're pregnant? I'm sorry, I shouldn't have... Yeah, me neither. But I did. Anyway. Oh. What about the other... Deadbeat Dad? You can catch him on the 40-yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Oh. Sorry to pry. It's not my business. And I won't be at the game Friday. Not much school spirit, I guess. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. And here we go again. Hey, Dana. Dana. What? Nobody imp It's like a... Of course. I... was pregnant. Was. Oh. That be dad? Who then? And you don't have to tell me. In fact, you better not. I like your spirit, Max. Now can I look at it? Oh, uh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. I'm gonna leave it like that. I said, please go. Max, enough. 
Oh, she, she wouldn't let me take the flash drive. She's so mad at me, I can't even take Warren's flash drive. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Hey, Dana. Dana. No, You're pregnant. Yeah. Oh. That beat that. Not my business. Sorry to... There you go. I like your... Now, I believe I have to do this to, say, to solve a problem later. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. See, see how it was out in the open before? And make it up to now, her. it is no longer out in the open. I said, please go. All right, later. I'm going. Boring, what's up? I hope so. I don't mind waiting out here forever. I love this parking lot. I can count all the cars. <laughs> I can count all the cars while waiting on that. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Oh. By the way, thanks, but we're not friends. Thanks. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. That was close. That was close. Jock assholes. If I was a member of the Vortex Club, they'd never pull that. Would you want to be a member? They're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. This must be for school required reading. All right, watch where you throw your football, sir. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. I'm not doing any interviews. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Take photo intervene. Intervene. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Hmm. I'll remember this conversation. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Well, oh well. It's action of consequences. It's action of consequences. The whole thing. Brooke is still flying her drone. I'm amazed that battery is still going. Only those things can only fly for like 30, 40 minutes, and it's like dead battery. Quick, count the cars, chat. Did you notice at the very beginning they showed a little squirrel again? It's very important. I'm glad I stepped in that time. I don't can't get stand it. to see people How being bullied. Before you do that to me. Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Mm -hmm. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. 
Have you talked to Zack yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexted Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren wants your attention. Oh, he it was usually does. Actually, Victoria. See you around, Max. And then Victoria claimed it was Juliet. I wonder how long before Samuel has to repaint that. Alright, we got a suspicious RV. Oh, look, this is Pomperdoodle. He's uh, a lot bigger now. That dog looks peaceful asleep, but if I get too close, Cujo. What is up here? Oh, look, it's a junkyard car. Oh, it doesn't have my Illuminati symbol, man. Wow. Who toilet papers a bike? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Max, get your ass over here. Later, Warren. I'm in a truck. <laughs> Leaflet. A new surveillance system. That's how it starts. Oh, this is his car. This is the head of security's car right here. Come on over here, please. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Oh! Thanks. No problem. Oh, he should have went for it. Come on, Warren. Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Wow. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. <laughs> You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? 60 it's miles been away. Strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. By the way, I saw Daniel's sketch of you online. Oh. Not bad, but I could do a much better job. You can draw. You can draw? I thought you were blinded by science, not art. <laughs> art is science. Music is math, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I'd put Stephen Hawking against Picasso any day. Hardcore. So you must use a computer to draw. Of course. I'd love to tweak one of your selfies with some cool graphics. That oh might not my suck. gosh, was that I'll Warren? So, did you get a chance to check Editing out the movie booty on the flash drive? Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. Oh my that gosh. does sound better than the thief. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Seen it. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sensitive. I swear this is a Twilight that reference. Sounds awful the way Ooh, you say love it. love Twilight. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black it's a movie white. title. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. No. I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Oh. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. Tell him everything. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max. Go on. Oh. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life changing. Life changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? 
Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal. Now. Answer me, bitch! Can I just say nothing? Does it time out? Anything to say, huh? Why oh, he looks so mad. Answer me, bitch! <laughs> I told him the truth. I told him the truth. A student Steve had a gun. gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's why he dragged me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone tries, though. <laughs> they try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me! I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. I could call the police. I could call the police. Do it! The Prescotts own the pigs here. Get away from her, dude! Oh, Warren! Hey! Leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom! No. Oh, she nearly got ran over. Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren. Go! Go! I got this! Oh no, Warren! Again, Max! Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! Dude, she nearly hit like every car in the parking lot. Man, Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. So what's five years? Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, there's the Illuminati oh, symbol. And thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Uh, hopefully. hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. Yeah, we really should go to that drive-in not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. Feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? I guess. It was cool, but I felt kind of lonely, out of my league. I would think you'd fit right in with the art school hipsters. Right. You look like the cover of hipstergirl.com. At least you're still a smartass. That's why I'm here. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Oh. Of course, we're not saying the other thing. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. Why? So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to see you? No. You were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. Give me a break. Give me a break. I was going through changes. Like you. I guess those changes included dumping me from your life. That's technically not true, true. No, it's technically Bullshit. true, Max. You thought you hook up with all these art pricks in Seattle. Didn't happen, though. You're merciless. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. Uh-oh. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. What? Don't use them on me, Max. She probably does. She literally just used it. Oh, there's her dragon tattoo on her arm. Broken. Oh, man, are you serious? Are you serious? Wow, haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tools. Very specific tools. tools. Alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. Welcome home, Max. <sighs> He's a tiny tool. Hmm. What does that mean? Wow. The 
garage doors are actually closed. Come on in. Don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home, shit, home. <laughs> yeah, they cleaned up the house a little on the outside. A bird is flying away. Everybody lies. Her posters have all changed. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Uh oh. We had such a blast drawing these together. And it reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. That is the bag Rachel Amber gave her. <gasps> Dude, you broke my glass. Thanks. Can I just do it again? Old cardboard boxes. Broke my glass. Where's like a stool? Thanks. I think this junk swallowed her discs. Trash can search. All right, girl, this is it. Disc. We got like 30 cents in here. Got a photo. Hey, give me that. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be oh, nosy. I wasn't trying to be nosy Obviously, as I acted good completely friend. nosy. It's putting it mildly. That's Rachel. That's Amber. Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Oh. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Rachel saved my life. That's Man, lovely. I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. Oh. So Rachel, Rachel took, took my place. place. I'm glad she was there for you. Rachel had my back. We were going to kick the world's ass. Hmm. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. It's true. It's she true. looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. So what happened? So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. That without word. a word. Without me. How do you know? How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Okay. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. Then poof. Oh gosh, it's Mr. Jefferson, isn't from it? Her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you met and someone who changed her life. Gone. Mr. Jefferson for Can sure. Can you put on some music now? Pythe jar. Oh, the mirror is gone. There used to be a mirror here. Said music on. Closet. 
Why are we, uh, I don't know where I put the music. This? Laptop? She looks super happy. She looks super sad. Wow. She looks super stoned. <laughs> what a transition. Who'd have thought Chloe wouldn't pay her parking tickets? She does love trouble. She probably couldn't afford him. We used to dare each other to climb down, but never did. Uh-huh. Go, Max. The player's over there. Over where? This postcard is from Rachel Ember. So she did send a postcard. Hi. It won't play without any power. Wow. What antique this is. Okay, okay, here we go. We're playing a CD chat. This is extreme. Chloe starts smoking in her room, and then trouble time. And Chloe anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Ooh, goodness me. Well, we're out of here. Okay, they want me to click the button to go downstairs, but I can... This <gasps> must be Chloe's parents' room. Man, I am nosy today. Close. You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, be free. You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, be free. Be free, or we're just gonna leave this window open and be cool with that. Oh, okay, Bird has been saved. Lights, stuff, hair dye, drawer. Go save the bird. That's all that matters. Nope. Someone locked it from the other side. Are you kidding me? Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the help. I haven't seen this place in five years. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all up. Okay. Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've got to be shitting me. Woo. Oh my gosh, that's where Chloe got the gun. There's one missing. Precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. Wow. That's a shaky washing machine. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. 